Ever pondered how even the most meticulously planned engineering marvels can turn into disastrous calamities? Well, my dear listener, you're not alone. Engineering, the very backbone of our modern society, is a fascinating, albeit complicated, beast. It's the reason we have skyscrapers kissing the clouds, vehicles that can whiz us around faster than a cheetah on caffeine, and gadgets that make life more comfortable than a cat in a sunbeam. Yet despite the best laid plans and brightest minds, things can go belly up. Yes, that's right, even the most brilliant engineers have had their oops moments. Those moments when the laws of physics decide to play a practical joke and the unforeseen consequences are, shall we say, a smidge more dramatic than a simple facepalm. So, fasten your seatbelts, tighten your hard hats, and hold on to your protractors. We are about to embark on a journey through some of the most colossal engineering mishaps in history. Remember the supposedly unsinkable ship that sank on its maiden voyage? Yes, the Titanic. Ah, the Titanic, a marvel of engineering in its time. The ship was designed to be the epitome of luxury and safety, boasting 16 watertight compartments. The designers were so confident in their creation, they hailed it as unsinkable. But as fate would have it, the ship met an iceberg on its maiden voyage, and the rest, as they say, is history. You see, the oversight was in the watertight compartments. They were not completely sealed at the top, so when the iceberg pierced the ship's hull, water began to flood in. As each compartment filled, the water simply spilled over into the next, much like a child's bucket brigade gone horribly wrong. In the end, the so-called unsinkable ship, the Titanic, found itself at the bottom of the North Atlantic. And just like that, the unsinkable Titanic sank, proving that even the greatest of engineering feats are not immune to disaster. Ever seen a bridge dance? Well, the Tacoma Narrows Bridge sure did, and like any good dance, it ended with a dramatic finale. Picture this, a bridge swaying like a drunken sailor, shimmying under the pressure of the wind. Quite the spectacle, wouldn't you say? The Tacoma Narrows Bridge was a marvel of engineering, a slender, graceful structure stretching across the chilly waters of the Tacoma Narrows Strait. But like many a beauty, it had a fatal flaw. Its design was aerodynamically unstable, making it susceptible to wind-induced vibrations, or as we engineers like to call it, aerodynamic flutter. Imagine a bridge not just swaying, but undulating, twisting and turning in the wind. It was a sight to behold, a magnificent, terrifying waltz that culminated in a spectacular collapse. A dance that ended not with a bow, but with a crash. And so, the Tacoma Narrows Bridge danced its way into the annals of engineering disasters. When it comes to engineering disasters, the Chernobyl nuclear accident takes the cake, or should we say, the radioactive apple. The Chernobyl power plant was a marvel of Soviet engineering, boasting four massive reactors and an energy output that could light up a city. But like a poorly made Yorkshire pudding, it was destined to collapse. The design had a few, let's call them, quirks. For one, the control rods designed to moderate the nuclear reaction actually increased it initially, which is a bit like trying to put out a fire with petrol. Then, during a safety test in 1986, the unimaginable happened. Due to a combination of design flaws and operator errors, reactor number four went into meltdown. Picture tossing a watermelon into a blender without the lid on. And thus, Chernobyl became the poster child for engineering disasters, reminding us all that with great power comes great responsibility. So what can we learn from these engineering disasters? Well, let's take a moment to reflect. Each disaster from the Titanic's icy encounter to Chernobyl's radioactive rave serves as a potent reminder of the importance of meticulous planning, comprehensive design and rigorous testing in engineering. You see, it's not just about building something that works. It's about building something that works even when the universe decides it's high time for a curveball. It's about ensuring that our creations can withstand the test of time the elements, and yes, even human error. But let's not forget the lighter side of things. These tales of woe and catastrophe can be a source of amusement too. After all, who doesn't love a good unsinkable ship sink story, right? And remember, even the greatest of minds can make mistakes. So the next time you're feeling down about a mishap, just remember, at least you didn't sink an unsinkable ship or cause a nuclear meltdown.